Welcome to the Medusa 4 tutorial, creating a side view. Select the line ribbon menu and click on the sweep profile tool to create the side view of the geometry. We start by selecting the C profile with the left mouse button. Then with the right mouse button, choose the second option, view direction. In the dialog, choose the view direction arrow on the left. Use the left mouse button to indicate the starting point and in the floating dialog the length value of 100. To create the side view of the plate we first need to make some construction lines. From the In Graphics menu select the Dynamic Construction Line tool. Use the Control key to enter the offset of 20. Place the construction line with the left mouse button on the left and right lines. Now change the input offset to 10. And this will represent the thickness of the plate. Place the new lines next to the existing construction lines. Use the escape key or the right mouse button option exit tool to leave the tool. From the Line Ribbon menu, again select the Sweep Profile tool and proceed to select the Plate Outline with the left mouse button, the Plate Hole with the middle mouse button, and again use the right mouse button option View Direction to activate the View Direction dialog. From the dialog, choose the View Direction by clicking on the left side arrow. Using the left mouse button, create the Plate View by clicking on the first construction line and then to create the hidden lines use the right mouse button option create hidden lines. Define the plate thickness by using the left mouse button to select the position on the second construction line. Repeat this process again to create the second plate view to the right. Note that the hidden line option is now still active. When finished, use the right mouse button option Exit Tool to leave the tool. To deselect all elements, use the Escape key or the right mouse button option Deselect All. We can now also delete the construction lines as these are no longer required and finally refresh the graphics using the refresh button from the In Graphics menu. This completes the tutorial creating a side view.